If I can very briefly summarize it, uh, Lidia Mendoza is, I think, uh, uh, certainly the cornerstone of, um, one of the cornerstones of Mexican-American music. Certainly she was a, a pioneer in the, um, in the performance uh, area as far as women is, are concerned. She was, in fact, the first woman ever to record. I mean, that's quite an accomplishment. Right, and that was when? That was in 1928. 28. 1928. Right. At the tender age of 14 years, he was only 14 years old mm -hmm. at the time. Um, <clears throat> as as, uh, as you and I both know, um, before her, very, very few women were involved in any sort of public performance. And so she was really a, a pathfinder in that sense, that she was uh, really one of the first Mexican-American, the first Mexican-American woman, in fact, to break that barrier. Heretofore, the, 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 the area of public performance had, had been almost exclusively, at least among the folk, all right, a male tradition. Right. Now, in the privacy of the homes, the women also sang and so forth, but in the public arena, she was the very first woman to do that. Well, we'll come back to some of those things that you mentioned and some other things that uh, we'll touch on. But um, before we get too much talk in this, uh, maybe we can have uh, Lydia start off with probably her best-known song, uh, uh, a wonderful, wonderful tune called Mal Hombre. Mal Hombre, la, la primera selección que yo grabé. The first song that she ever recorded. As a solo artist. As a solo artist. Right. Let me explain very briefly that when she, her first recordings in 1928, she was leading her, the, her family's group. Later she went on to record solo in 19, 1934. This was her song. Right, so this goes back to 1934 on, on one of her records. <laughs> Ma, Malombre, I like to translate that as evil hearted man. Aviéntese la Lidia. Pues como no, seguro que sí. Oh. Una canción que ya ve la cantidad de años que han pasado y donde quiera que yo me presento, la piden y ahora también entre otros públicos está siendo muy popular. <risa> bueno, pues con mucho gusto, mal hombre. Tienes César, mujer, tú la conoces, 
y a la vez respondiste una cualquiera al oír de tus labios al traje demostraba también lo que tú eras mal hombre tan ruin es tu alma que no tiene nombre 